All right, I'm here. Jesus, don't... Don't sneak up on me like that. Did you find anything out about Sarah, about the woman that I put on your chopper? Nothing. Nothing? Hey, hey, wait, 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 wait. It's gonna take some time, okay? I'm risking my neck here. If anyone the, the back at HQ finds out, uh, those guys with the guns over there, You're they'll all order the without same question. Team, look, it just looks that way. Look, I don't have time to explain it right now, but it's why I need your help. My help? Just, look, just take it. It's a, it's a wavelength recorder and some GPS trackers. I just need you to... We're out of time. Look, I... Shit, I don't even know your name. Deacon, Deacon St. John. Well, look, Deacon St. John, if you want me to risk my neck helping you find whatever her name, uh, Sarah, then, yeah, I'm gonna need you to do something for me. Okay. Keep the radio close. I'll contact you in a couple of minutes. Hey, I came by to see how the lazy bastard's doing. How you doing, uh. booze man? Are you, are you tired of laying around yet? Boozer. Hey, uh, you can't be in here, Deacon. Come on, hey, come what's on, going Deacon. on? How's he doing? He needs his rest. Uh, don't mess around with me, Addy. I asked you, how was he doing? I'm good, I'm good. Uh, not good. Uh, Damn, it's cold. Uh, the they're not enough. <laughs> they're never enough. Oh, wait a second, you said that I... I said that we would try. <laughs> Look, all we can do is wait. Okay. All right. Deacon, no, Deacon, there's, uh, you Deacon, know what? There's Deacon, something I can do about Deacon, this. Stop, I can get stop. What? I know you want to smash something. I see that look yes. in your eyes. But you know what? You go right ahead, but you do it out there. Daddy, go. I can... Look, <sighs> there is nothing else you can do. Please, just go home. Go home, Deacon. Uh. Dick, Dick. So this drifter, he's working in the control tower when the plane disappears off the radar. Poof. Now you see it, now you don't. Right about here. South of Mount Washington. That's what he said. It came down intact. A controlled crash or whatever. The guys got to listen to the pilot bleeding out from a broken pelvis on the ground. Okay, so you haven't sent anyone to find this? Nope. Why not? Because the old man won't have it. Iron Mike, what the... Oh, right. Rippers. <laughs> you catch on quick. Everything west of the Iron Ridge here belongs to Carlos and his merry band of bald-headed freak oh, Shit. So you go over there and you get caught, you head north, brother. Otherwise, Iron Mike's treaty with rest and peace goes okay, no, no, like no, I get it, I get it. Let me ask you a question. Why are you telling me this? Oh, wait a minute. First off, I'm not telling you shit. You remember that? Second off, you're a goddamn drifter. What am I supposed to do? Follow you around like I'm your little bitch, keep your ass out of trouble? All right. I have things to do. I get it. You're just a regular stand-up guy, right, Schizo? Just trying to stay alive. Like everybody else. <sighs> hey. You do what you gotta do. At the end of the day, that's all we got. Do you know what I'm saying? I know what you're saying, Schizo. Keep your radio close. I'll be in touch. Schizo, it's St. John. I'm at the border. You see any of my men around? No, Schizo, it's clear. Look, how much time do I got? Time? Time for what? All I know is I got a card game going on with a few of my guys. A couple of them maybe that should be out on guard duty. But I'm letting that slide. If I had to guess, I'd say we'd be playing all night. So until morning, got it, Deacon out.
That's Deacon. Behind him! You? You. Right up the road. Make sure they don't come back. Now! What was left of them? Yeah. What was left of them? Hey, I heard gunshots. What's going on? We had a run-in with a few rippers, but I handled it. You handled it? What is it? Wow. I should have known. You should have known what? Jesus, Ricky, who's running security here? You know, I ask myself that shit every single day. I'm done here. Good. So what are you doing out here? What am I doing, Dick? Okay, Addy told me to come and get you. Why? What? Hold on for a second. Is Boozer okay? I don't know. We gotta go. William! William, if you can hear me, I need you to stop! Addy, what's going on? Boozer? <clears throat> go and hold him. What the hell are you doing? Listen, what are you doing? Listen, I'm we need to do arm. this and we need to do this right you now. What? No! Don't you... Oh, don't no. you take Deacon. it! No, no! De no, you're not... No way! No, you're not gonna Deacon, do this to him! Deacon, listen to me! The antibiotics will save his life, but nothing on God's earth is gonna save the arm. Now listen, I need you to help me right now, or you can just watch your friend die. Okay. we're losing him! Wait! Deacon. All right. All right, all right. Come on. Hey, pal. Hey, pal. All right, hey, I just need you to stay hold with him. me. Hold him there. Okay. Hold him. Deacon. Deacon. Okay. Hold him down right there. Okay, okay, okay. Ah! Ah! Oh, my goodness. Ah! No, no, no. He's losing too much blood. You gotta stop. He's losing too much blood. Hand me the gun. Ah! 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 Oh! Oh, no. Loser, come on, man. Come on. Hold him! Okay, pal, where? Where do I hold him? Just hold him like this. Stop panicking I'm and hold him. Hey. You did good in there. When I was in high school, I thought, hmm, maybe I should be a mechanical engineer. Or should I be a surgeon? I guess I should have been a surgeon. <laughs> oh. And you. Hey, hey, okay. You know, you saved your friend's life today. I don't think he's gonna see it that way. Yeah, well, I think he will. I gotta go and give him his IV drip. And you know what? I don't know where you got all this, and I don't want to know. But it's gonna save a lot of lives, Deacon St. John. A lot of lives. I gotta go help Addy. Mike, just settle down, okay? Deacon! Get out here! <clears throat> I heard what you did. I wasn't about to let him die. Mike, let it go. It's done. I know that, goddammit. Who's there gonna live? I don't know. The Ripper saw you, followed you back. When Carlos finds out about this, there's gonna be the devil to pay. Carlos can go fuck himself. You are writing checks with other men's blood. I hope you're good with that. You did what had to be done. Mike, wait up.
Brian, I'm at one of your beacons. Which one? What do you mean, which one? This Nero radio has a GPS, doesn't it? Yes, of course it does. I, uh, uh, okay. Uh, you're at Olali Falls. Okay, good. Uh, uh, keep an eye out. A field op is gonna be there any minute. I'll Brian out. Oh, Brian! Oh, God damn it. O'Brien, come in. Your friends are here. O'Brien. I told you they're not my friends. Okay, head in on foot. Hey, Ricky, you said you had a job for me? Hey, Deke. Yeah. You remember Shane Riley? Everyone called him Red? Red Riley. Yeah, never heard of him, but let me guess. Ginger? But red hair? No. It was his boots. He wore these rattlesnake boots dyed with god-awful red color. He made quite the impression. <laughs> no, I bet. Anyway, he used to do runs for us back in the day until one day he decides he didn't like the camp credits we were paying. So he up and kills Lindsay Fuller. Who? Lindsay. Worked supply before Blair. Wait a second, so he killed an unarmed woman? Oh, she was armed. She just wasn't expecting him to shoot her in the face. Will you listen? So Red murders her, cleans out her supply hut, and then takes off before anyone knows what's happened. Got away clean. Oh, that son of a bitch. Until now. He and his men have been spotted up at Camp Pioneer. You don't gotta ask. I, uh, I got this thing about, um... About killing unarmed women. I know. So I knew you'd want to handle it. Yeah, like I said, I got this covered. Um, what else can you tell me about him? Not much. Oh, wait. He chews tobacco. I heard he was such an addict that he rounds up cigarette butts, takes out the tobacco, and chews that. Well, that's disgusting. So now I got two reasons to kill him. Yeah, but be careful, Deke. Hey, hey, Ricky, I got him. Deacon, what a relief. Lindsay has some folks she was close to. I'll let him know. Yeah, okay. I'll see you around, Ricky. Deke? I've been, uh... Thinking about what you were saying about doing something to make a difference around here, pay back the camp. I'm listening. Do you got a few minutes? I want to show you something. Yeah, guess I can spare you a minute or two. Goddamn freaks! Yeah. Okay, okay. Come on. Wait, wait, wait. Follow him. Where the hell are we going? You'll see. Come on. I'll be goddamn. Yeah. They stand there all day, hibernating or whatever the hell freaks do. So, what are you thinking that we? Yep. Blow it the hell up. Stick it down to my there, there, and there. We'll bring down a mountain of rock. We seal this shit up. Yeah, so we trap a few hundred inside. What good is that gonna no, do? No, no, you don't get it. We seal this cave. Maybe they don't got no place to sleep. Or maybe this trail of piss and shit dries out, goes stale, and others stop coming. Yeah. All right. All right. You get my attention. Okay, come on, let's head back. Job like that, it's gonna take a fair amount of TNT. You said you wanted help making Lost Lake safer. This is how we do it. All right. All right, look. There's some things I gotta do. Okay, but you meet me at the bridge in a couple of minutes. I know where we can find some. <laughs> 